60 seconds. What's your screw? Today, Friday or Saturday? Today is Friday, you nimbus. It's Friday at 9.49 o'clock. No filming today, but we knew we had something going on later today. So, uh, before we get into that, you want to tell the listeners, viewers, about the uh, the recent entertainer you discovered that's been eating up blood. Ah, uh, yeah. Norm MacDonald. Absolutely love him. Well, shout out to Russell Van Gilder, our cousin. He's like, you guys got to check him out. You'd love his stuff. Yeah, but the funny thing was is we didn't. He said that. We forgot. And, no, we didn't know. We were watching I know. Celebrity Jeopardy. I didn't think about it anymore. Yeah. We were watching Celebrity Jeopardy on YouTube. And he, he is Burt Reynolds. He plays Burt Reynolds on SNL Celebrity, on SNL Celebrity Jeopardy. Celebrity Jeopardy. And we were watching it last Friday. And, and you I wanted said, to know. Who, oh, I was like, who, who plays Burt Reynolds? Yeah. And uh, the YouTube video said Norm MacDonald. And we are like, oh. And also just told us about Norm. Burt Reynolds, Terry Ferguson, is hilarious. So, last Sunday, I dove. I went down the rabbit hole. And I watched about three hours of Norm on YouTube uh, highlight videos with him on different interviews. And then I uh, watched his stand-up special <laughs> last Sunday. And I was in tears. He's hilarious, but he's a very uh, uh, well, today, Taylor type of humor. Yeah, it's very, very dry. He's, he, I, I love him. He's probably my favorite comic. Is it for the faint of heart? Probably not for everyone. But I, uh, his uh, Netflix special just came out today. Yes. And uh, I watched the first two episodes, and it's hilarious. So Norm MacDonald, my favorite comic, absolutely love him. He is, his type of humor is our type of humor. So check that out. Also that dropped today was Eminem's... That's where I thought you were going. Oh, really? Yeah. Also big news. Eminem's response to Machine Gun Kelly's diss. Love it. He brought the fire. Uh, love it. It was good. I've probably listened to it ten times already. Really? It's pretty sweet. So this was listened to it on repeat down there. As Kenny phrased it, today was a good day for drops. So he said, "Good day for drops." Yeah, like Netflix drop. Oh yeah, special. yeah. Anyway, yeah. Eminem's kill shot is kill shot. That's what it's called. Oh, I love Eminem. I think he's the goat. I think he's the greatest rapper of all time. I like MGK. I think he has a lot of good music. There's a lot of music I like, and I really like MGK's rap devil. Just of Eminem. His beat was sick. His lyrics were insane. He did good. And I was stoked to see what Eminem said. And Eminem brought the heat. He the the complexity and the lyrical genius of Eminem is unmatched. Unrivaled. You do, you do not diss him. No. I, I was watching right. part two of his Sway interview downstairs when you came down and said, Hey, listen. I was just watching yeah. part two and you came down and said, Hey, Eminem just dropped this uh his but, response. you know, like with what Machine Gun Kelly did, um, it's almost like McGregor challenging Mayweather. Like, the chances of McGregor beating the world's greatest boxer in True. his own arena was slim to none. But he made he, so much he, money he in publicity. Nothing. He loses nothing, and he got all that money and publicity out of it. Not to say that Machine Gun Kelly won't lose anything, but he's going to get a bunch of uh, uh, publicity. Like, Eminem said he's turning a molehill into a mountain. Uh, yeah. So... It's a, a pretty much a win-win for M. It's a win-win. Oh, and I mean, even for M, because yeah, I mean, his last album about. was really a bust, and now the spotlight's on him. Yep. So, lots of good content out there right now. And then tonight is the night of Friday. Now we're heading to the York Project. Guys are having a little bonfire at their business complex, right? Pony ride, yeah. The uh, complex that like they're renting space from. I think it's like a point right event. All right, so anyway, we're gonna go to that, and it's BYOB, we got some beers, we're gonna Uber down there and see what it's all about. It says it goes till two. Mm -hmm. So it's almost... We're the, the kind of guys It's almost that, ten uh, now. Our presence is felt, and we're just fashionably late. You know? We'd like to sh be that, show up for the last half rather than the first half. That's where all the fun is, so we're gonna head out to there soon, and see what the night's all about. Cabs are here. Red Bull for the road. Thanks, man. All right, we are here, but not exactly sure where to go. We're just gonna follow the noise till we hear. Man, I hear the music.
very competitive game of beer pong. My brother and I were a little rusty, but we're gonna make it. First game, we had to get warmed up. It was a slow start. We got the W. <laughs> the kids are hungry. I mean, Kelly says make sure you get the last. The cup says make sure you get the result. A little cocky. Yeah. Yeah. We can't be sure. Selfies. You want in? Oh yeah. Here, cheers. Video. Oh. oh yeah. We're vlogging. Well, we ran the table for a while, and then we had epic loss. But all in all, some good wins, good dubs. We got back in the table. We got back in the saddle. We didn't want to, but we had to. We had to own the beer bunk table. We lost one game. We probably won ten. We lost all win. A lot. I mean, a lot of wins. easy money. Next phase. How you doing? Time for a nightcap. At Jay's.